Hey guys, Lobo here, and welcome back to this part of Pokemon Legends Arceus. Last time, we dealt for Ur Ursulona and the whole rampage. Apparently, we found out that it wasn't a rampage, and Arezu was lying because apparently there's a Lilligan going in a frenzy. So we were told to go search that later on, which what we're gonna do later. But first, I want to talk about what I did off screen. Which what I did basically is I caught more Pokemon, I explored more. I have a Munchlax as you can see right here. And I got a Curlia. Uh I evolved Ross. We found last time, I think. And I caught multiple because I wanted a good nature since I wanted a good laid. And also about this Eevee. I wanted to evolve it into a Glaceon. It can evolve into Espeon, Umbreon, or Sylveon. But yeah. I'm trying to find the Ice Stone, and that's kind of hard. Apparently, you can't get that until the end game. Yes. I don't know why. I caught this Munchlax, which, again, in Obsidian Field or whatever. In the other area. I'm not... Why do I keep talking to you? However, exploring... Right here, right? Going to Drowning Meadow. It was somewhere around here. Oh, Lake Valor. I barely even noticed that. Right near here, somewhere around here, right? I was searching around that area and I found a Pokemon. Well, there's eight pastors. I found me a Tertway. I also found all these. I found a Shellos. I got some Magikarp back, which I'm interested. I want a Gyarados. I don't know. I already have a water type. But yeah, I caught a couple more Eevees to evolve into Espeon, and eventually I caught a Licky Tongue as well. And I got a female Combi, which was hard. I kept searching for it off screen and off screen and off screen. But yeah, we also got a Turtwig. This is the Curlia I was leveling up in my shelf. But yeah, I'm gonna move Turtwig in. Because I wanna look at him. Look at him. I love Turtwig. Yeah. We're gonna use him. But before that, as you can see, we got a couple of evolutions. So let's do this. Gengar would be so amazing to have. I would enjoy having a Gengar. I don't know if we're gonna, again, I don't know what the final team is gonna be other than I'm gonna have to lay it in Glaceon and Samurai. So we got half the team, but the other half, I'm not necessarily sure. It's still up for debate. But yeah, finding a female combi is one of the hardest shits to do. And I want to use Best Queen because I never used one before. But it took me forever to find a female combi. Now we got a Best Queen. And I'm not going to evolve Eevee just yet. Let me see, let me see. Bessie Queen, have you learned new moves? Yup. So they keep the moves, okay. Nope, let me confirm. I also figured this out off screen. You can actually kind of do this. Let me see what a uh, Haunter can learn. Nothing yet. What about Turtwig? Oh, he already has it. Okay, the well, turtle is going to be in the background for most of this. Look at best between though. Not as big as I thought you were going to be. I ran into an alpha best between. That's probably why I'm saying that. Well, yeah, we're going to continue and hopefully deal with that little again. I'm going to, I found this area, which is a diamond clan camp. Yeah. Let's continue off this way. Probably going to skip until we get there. I don't find nothing interesting. And we made it. All right, let's see what's going on. 
Fucking uh, Adam, man. What you got? So you've came. I take it that means you're ready. Sure. So is this going to be like fever again? Lady Lilligan to sight to see. Even in Frezzy. Behold her and be grateful. Hope we didn't keep you waiting. All it took was one of my poultices uh, to get Rezu's leg all patched up. Caliber, ma'am, I'm deeply sorry we had to lean on your help so much, especially as we're from different clans. Rezu tried to solve the situation herself. I dare say she's a bit off more than she could chew. She bit off more than she could chew and caused some trouble, but her heart was in the right place. Yeah. Unlike the actual galactic members from Diamond and Pearl were all assholes. The Galactus Anchester seem nice. Team, it could change. Listen, the Lady of the Ridge, Lilligan, is like a dancer, always in motion, always darting about. You'll want to watch her real close and learn how to dodge her moves. But I'm assuming she's going to be harder than Cleaver. Well, obviously. That's right. If you keep on dodging, she might get tired and that'll be your opening. That's when you can bring out your own Pokemon. Prove your mind. Don't let me down. Maybe I could actually use a Pokemon, unlike the Cleaver situation. Because there's such a short amount of time in there. Let's see, let's see. Yo! Yo! Hold up! I didn't know about this! They changed her form! Yeah, that's pretty badass. I'm not gonna lie. How does it look like? I'm so thankful I skipped a lot of spoilers. K kind of. Come on. Alright, battle. So oh, we're just gonna do this. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Nope. Come on. Get her down some. Oh shit, 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 I know how to dodge. That was just an accident, man. Okay, that was close. Do this. Oh. Yo, yo. Yo. yo chill out. Uh, 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 uh. Let's be Quentin. Come on. I'm assuming she's still pure grass type, so... Oh. Nope. Oh, I just thought it didn't have any effect. I would Uh. Silver Wayne, get the boost. Oh, she's part fairy type, isn't she? Uh. Struggle bug. Do more special or physical? Agile style. Poison powder. I think that just boosts accuracy, right? That's like, like really? Energy ball? You could have done something better. Uh, Gustin? Hopefully that does. Yeah, that, that hurt enough. Just gonna spam. Got her a little... She has less life than Cleaver though. I'm assuming it's a Cleaver, right? You said, yeah, Cleaver. God damn it. Come on. Some damage. Okay, we're almost down. Boom. Hit me. I'm bad at dodging. I don't know that. Oh no, shit. God, how oh, oh my god. I'm gonna die. Come on. Oh crap, I need quick. Come on. Almost there, almost there. 
a couple more hits. Oh crap, crap, crap. What happened? Oh, done. So we don't go all, all the way down to zero, like, technically. How does she look like, though? I'm so curious. I didn't think they would give her another design. Do they have Whimsicott as another design? Oh, shit. Oh, God. I'm worried now. But I like her design. She kind of looks like that one character from Sonic X. I forgot her name. She reminds me of her. But I like the design, though. The design's cool. Hey, thank you. You didn't just save Lilligant, you save Arezu as well. I appreciate it. First Ursaluna, and now Lilligant? You're amazing, you know that. Being all friends, you didn't suit Lilligant one bit. I'm so happy she's back to her graceful self. Arezu, you still so owe someone an apology. Huh? Oh, don't worry about it. A young one like her is bound to get caught up in some trouble from time to time. Remember, that's written in the Celestion Ruins. All lives touch other lives to create something anew and alive. There is wisdom in those words. I imagine they're teasing of Almighty Sinnoh itself. I like how this is going off full circle. Of course, I'd completely forgotten about them until a certain somebody helped me remember. We owe you one, ma'am. Don't try to solve everything by yourself, Arezu. You're a warden of all people. We should know how to stand in solidari solidarity with others. Our job is to stand side by side with Pokemon, after all. Yes, I know. I'm sorry. I can hardly start yelling at you now after Calibur wrapped up all that so nicely. Just one more thing, Arezu. I know you were trying to do what you thought was right, and I approve of that. From now on, out, but from now on, I do it without keeping things from me agreed. Other than that, no need to change a thing, except maybe to put in some training. If anything else happens to Lilligan, I need you ready to protect her like the warden that you are. I understand. Let's work together from now. Keep the Myrland safe, Arezu. I'll be sure to inform our writer that both the Diamond Clan and Galaxy team helped save our Saluna. We did well too. All of our different groups finally joined hands to work together today. I admit it was a fun day for me, but now it's about time I'll be on my way. Listen, you know me. I'm Adaman, leader of the Diamond Clan, and I worship Almighty Sinnoh, the ruler of time. Time is all about change, and we can't live in fear of that. We can only try to help time we live in change for the better. Something tells me that helping you folks out will help me do that. I'm looking forward to it. Thank you for everything, Lobo. I think I'll stay and talk to Lilligan for a while. What happened, Lilligan? How a kind-hearted Pokemon like you end up all frenzy, huh? Well, it's not like a perfect... I hit things and lied and couldn't even keep you safe. I'm real sorry about everything. How about you let me use Lilligan? Oh yeah, anyways. Search with Evolve. We didn't even use him. Evolve. He's going to evolve. We got ourselves a grotto. He's going to be in the team for a while. That's for sure. Unless I get a Chimchar. I need a fire type. That That's something I do need. Maybe next area? Let me see. What moves do you got? Move. Nah. What about Vesky Queen? I think you said you learned a new move. Slash. Uh. Are you more physical or special? You're kind of split. Uh. It doesn't matter. I'll keep it right now. I won't change. What should I do? I guess it's time to leave. Let's go back. You're a real wonder. I saw light disappearing into space-time rift. Quelled another frenzied Pokemon, have you? We still don't know what's causing the lightning that frenzies these Pokemon, but you just go on rescuing them without even a hit of trepidation. What does that word mean? You might even change the entire course of the history, and I definitely want to be in the good books of someone like that. Let's stay in touch, friend. I thought we were going to battle. Anyways, I'm done. Actually, let me switch my Pokemon real quick. Since we can't use items 
or we can't buy the item or get the item yet to evolve Haunter since he's not leveled up. Let me use Magikarp for a little while. I didn't mean to look at that. Uh, yeah, I also ranked up off screen and I hope it carries over. I'm gonna be mad if it doesn't. I'm not raking up anymore. What's going on, Benny? What's good? Found her by the scent of my mochi. Did you? Of course you did. When you leave my level of skill, your handiwork can be recognized from a mile away. Remember to be thankful for getting to eat such masterful mochi when you come for dinner later. Why is your hair green, though? That's what I'm wondering. But first, don't you owe Commodore report? Your meal can wait. Yeah, but I'm gonna rank on first before that. Also, my I didn't talk about this, but I got some higher levels because I've been doing missions off screen. Three ranks. Come on. So what's new? Ah, with this you have officially attained the rank of the third star in the Galaxy Expedition Team. Great balls. Yo! I'm never gonna use them. So let's go up here. Go talk to Captain Commodore. Commander Commodore. I don't know. What's good, Kamado? Let's see what you got for us now. But yep, we did. Excellent. There may be well be times when the Galaxy team will be forced to fight against Pokemon, but it is all for the sake of creating a new home for ourselves free from a war and strife. A stranger falls into our world from a rift in space and time, then frenzies are induced by a strange lightning, which likewise falls from the very same rift. But have you no connection to the lightning, isn't that right? We may need to investigate the rift itself to prove your... Motors are beyond impugging. Impugging. Whatever. What's our next goal, man? I just want to catch new Pokemon. I'm just... I want to play this game all the time. That's one of the reasons why I've been doing a lot of missions off screen. There you go. Piping hot potato mochi fresh from the stove. Now this is life enjoying tasty potato mochi with friends, sharing the latest findings from our Pokemon research and topping it all off with a good night's sleep. Truly, who could ask for anything more? I don't disagree, yet I keep doing the same thing day after day. Is it really getting us anywhere with our research or carving with our life here? Oh, well here's a flashy new recipe to try, Lobo. It's for an item that should help scatter these gloomy thoughts. Calm now, don't you worry yourself so, my girl. As a wise man once said, trust in yourself and you will find your way. These words are worth taking to heart. As long as we truly believe in ourselves, I'm sure we'll even complete the Pokedex of ours someday. And that's facts. Gotta keep working day by day, step by step. You'll get there eventually. Morning, sleepyhead. Can we have like a dating simulator? I mean, you'll never guess what. I'm going to start working at the hairdresser shop. Oh, now you'll be able to try out my original hairstyles. Isn't that super exciting? Oh, I'm still going to be Lilligan's ward and all, but I'm burning the candle on both ends. But I can make it work. Don't you worry. That's cool. Anyway, you come over to the hairdresser when you can, Lobo. I'll give you a killer hairstyle. How about we just don't? Mr. Commodore, sir. Uh, so about that whole Ursulona situation. You are here. You are to work here in Jubilee Village. You are family to us, no matter who you are or where you're from. Welcome in a Rizzo. So nice. New Lobo, you will come with me. Prelude Beach. <gasps> Bro, is this? D 
These people have just arrived here in Hisui. They will live together with us in Jubilife Village. Can I have your kimono? Because it looks dope as hell. When we of the Galaxy team first arrived, I don't know why I just saw it and I just thought about it. Arrived in this land, we can assure on Prelude Beach is where everything began. This is where a new life for all of you will begin as well. You've heard that the Hushua region is inhabited by many powerful and frightening Pokemon. But we also heard the Galaxy team knows a great deal about Pokemon and uses their mysterious power to help Jubilife Village grow. Indeed, you have both heard correctly, and the reason such tales have reached your, your ears is largely thanks to Lobo here. One of our Survey Corps recruit. Through the combined efforts of all our team members, let us continue to develop our village and thrive here in the Hushui region. We look forward to doing our part, Commander. These advancements of our understanding of Pokemon, thanks for, to the survey courts, has been expanded to areas where we can operate safely. That is what allows us to welcome in the newcomers like them. Lobo, you truly do love Pokemon, don't you? I do. Pokemon have gone to grave injury to many of our fellows in the Galaxy team. Yet you still find love for these creatures in your heart. I suppose it is necessary quality for one of the survey corps. Remember this, tough. Though Pokemon are terrifying creatures, it is imperative that we study them and learn all that we can about them, whether we wish to live alongside them or not. Be warned, as the leader of the Galaxy team, I am prepared to make hard decisions in order to protect your life village. Commander, a rider from the Pearl Clan arrived. Good, I believe I know what she's here about. For you, Lobo, you should see yourself how Jubilee Village is changing thanks to the Survey Corps' efforts, and you will come to my office. Yo! Just leave us out here? Is there any Pokemon out here? Yo, that commander though, Commodore seems like a chill dude, but he looks like he'll fuck you up if he needs to. We haven't been here before, have we? Oh, I didn't mean to take a picture. Yeah, this is kind of new. Be any spawns or I'm assuming not though. Be cool if there is. Oh wait, I don't think so. I don't think this is an area because I can't use word here or uh, or Saluna. Okay, I'm stupid. Yeah. God. Okay, we're gonna go back. Give me a minute. Right, now our first step actually also this side mission he thinks this is a silkoon god is he in for a surprise i did that off screen he evolved i just spoke to him and then he just evolved but anyways let's go up to kamado and see what he wants what's going on with our writer and everything I commend you on your successful research of the Pokemon living in the Crimson Mirelands. Your next order is to begin a survey of Cobalt Coastlands. I will let you know in advance there are no Pokemon nobles in the Cobalt Coastlands. Allow me to explain. We did have a lord in the coastlands until a few years ago a tragedy took him from us. Damn. We're really getting dark in this game. Now we had reports of people seeing strange shadowy figures on the island the lord used to call it his home. They have also received word from, word from the both of the security corps and supply corps. It seems some of their members were attacked by a ghost while out gathering materials around Firespit Island. Those are these are serious concerns. And moreover, my clan just can't tolerate this desecration of our late Lord's seat. Normally, I entrust this to our warden in the coastline, but her situation is complicated. I trust my intentions are clear. By now, I hereby order you to investigate these reports. The 
think of nothing of it, Lobo is talented and a hardworking member of the galaxy team. I'm sure he will sort things out. Indeed, Lobo quote the Lord of the Woods. I've seen both his strength and kindness firsthand. Yeah. There you have. The next area for you to investigate would be the Cobalt Coastland. It is farther afield from the Crispin Myerlands. Much farther, and the path is long and trying. Yep. You, thank you for believing me in Silene. But. I think that's going to be it for this part. Probably the shortest part yet. But yeah, we took on Lilligant. I love her design and hope I could get one later. I don't know. Well, I'm assuming get the Sunstone, right? From this girl. And how many mirror points do I have, actually? I have almost 500. I'm looking for the Ice Stone and the Dawn Stone. I heard you should get the Ice Stone first, however. Since it's much harder to get. But yeah. Dealt with Lilligan. Calmed her anger. And... Yeah. That's about it. I don't know what else to say. Next time we're off for the Cobalt Coastlands. A new area I'm excited for. But until then, hope you guys enjoyed. If y'all did, consider subscribing and liking. And bye.